Hey guys, this is Ranjit Singh again with my new video. Uh, this time I found this treadmill uh, that has running motor in it. I took it out, took out the board right there. Um, only took out what I need. I mean like I left the incliner in there right now. Maybe later I'll do something with it. And that uh, speed sensor. Uh, I wanted to check it out just like this because uh, I seen the video on YouTube that says that we might have to disconnect the part of the circuit board so it won't it would not interfere while the motor is running um, I did not do that yet I wanted to see how everything goes so the LED is on and I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on to show you guys that it works. I'm gonna connect the blue line. I'm gonna show you why I disconnected it. Here we go. Nope. Just temporarily. Okay. And uh, the LED is on here's one mile per hour motor is spinning what I did last night is <clears throat> I had it on uh, one mile per hour um, I left it on for like five minutes to see if uh, without any other accessory it would keep going or it might stop or change the speed but I, it did not do nothing. It stayed like this. It worked really good. Went on. And then I went to 5 mile per hour. The motor spun really good. No problem at all. And uh, this wire that goes from the control board to the circuit board. This is... Uh, this is the wire that controls inclining or um, it controls the other stuff but uh, what I did I cut the wire first and then connected each wire to their um, colors um, then what I did I started the motor and I started disconnecting each wires as I go because uh, I had this diagram I found it inside the unit so I followed it and I disconnected the wires you can see I have disconnected most of them and only left with three this is orange white solid orange and uh, solid blue why I disconnected the blue you might have seen in the beginning of the video that it was disconnected the reason being is that I was testing it um, if we want to hide everything under the table and and cut the slot here to bring the uh, bring our uh, belt out to connect to any pulley or anything on the top of the table just like this so we don't see nothing on the top then we can hide this underneath the table hide the circuit board underneath the table and then we set our speed whatever speed we need let's say 5 mile per hour we set it up and then this blue right here We'll take a switch and connect the switch right here, right on the top of our table in somewhere in the front so we can turn it on and off. And <coughs> I just disconnected the blue wire and you can see the motor is almost stopping, which means it works like a switch. So I'll show you in a second when it stops that when I connect it again, it won't change its speed. It'll it'll start 
or it'll go to the same speed where I stopped it here I'm connecting the blue wire again here you see and here's disconnecting again so that mean it will work like like a switch if we connect the switch in between so I think so far so good um, this is how I'm gonna the way I'm gonna go the way I told you like I'm gonna hide everything in the bottom and maybe expose the um, the numbers only the speed numbers only where I can change the speed or maybe only the speed up and down whatever I'll see how it will go but as, as far as uh, I was concerned about um, disconnecting the half of the circuit board or um, make some changes I, I, I'm not gonna do nothing like that I think I'm gonna try to go the way I found out that it works and have a toggle switch right on the top of the or side of the table to turn it on and off and then if I need to change the speed I can go under the table uh, open the door or something and change the speed right there on the control board which would be sitting in the bottom uh, just for the prank I might take this off to to have it uh, as fun uh, for other people who are gonna come by and try to turn it on it might not turn on and that'd be really good uh, that'd be funny uh, anyway so I think um, these three wires works on this panel this is MC2100 sorry about upside down because I set it up like this I don't want to touch it so everything works really good let me know if uh, I'm wrong somewhere or I have to do something else to it but uh, I think for me right now this is how I gonna set it up thank you guys